Dear viewers, greetings. In this video, we are going to see about catalyst test. The aim of the catalyst test is to test the catalyst enzyme producing efficiency of bacteria and the principle uh, catalyst test is used to differentiate the bacteria that produce an enzyme catalyst uh, such as uh, Staphylococcus species and Bacillus species from the non-catalyst producing bacteria such as Streptococcus species and Bacillus species. Uh, in 1893, a publication by Gordstein uh, brought attention to bacterial catalyst, uh, making it one of the first bacterial enzyme. And next, aerobic and facultative anaerobic organisms produce two toxins during its normal metabolism. Uh, one is hydrogen peroxide and another one is superoxide radical. Uh, these bacteria have two enzymes uh, that detoxify the products of normal metabolism. One of these enzymes is uh, catalyst. Uh, it is capable of converting hydrogen peroxide to water and oxygen. Normally, 5% uh, hydrogen peroxide is used for the detection of catalyst in bacteria. Uh, the presence of catalyst enzyme in a uh, bacterial isolate is evident when a small amount of inoculum is introduced into hydrogen peroxide and the rapid elaboration of oxygen bubbles occurs. Uh, the lack of catalyst is evident by a lack of or weak bubble, form, uh, weak bubble production. Uh, the culture used for the catalyst test uh, should not be more than 24 hours old. The catalyst positive bacteria include uh, strict aerobes as well as uh, facultative anaerobes. Although they all have the ability to respire using oxygen as a terminal electron acceptor. Catalyst negative bacteria may be anaerobes or uh, they may be facultative anaerobes that only ferment and do not respire using oxygen as a terminal electron acceptor. The materials required for the uh, catalyst test are uh, test bacteria, 5% uh, hydrogen peroxide, glass slide or test tube and sterile wooden stick or glass rod. A procedure for tube catalyst test. Uh, first, uh, pour 1 to 2 ml of 5% uh, hydrogen peroxide solution into the test tube. After that, uh, using a sterile wooden uh, stick or a glass rod, uh, take several colonies of the 18 to 24 hours uh, test organisms and immense in the 5% hydrogen peroxide solution and finally observe for the immediate bubble, bubbling or bubble formation. And next procedure for slight catalyst test. Uh, first, use a sterile wooden stick or glass rod to transfer a small amount of colony growth in the surface of a clean uh, dry glass slide and then uh, place a drop of 5% hydrogen peroxide in the glass slide and finally observe for the evolution of uh, oxygen bubbles. Uh, observation and results for uh, catalyst test. Uh, catalyst positive test shows immediate bubble formation and catalyst negative test shows no bubble formation. Uh, some examples for catalyst positive bacteria are Staphylococcus species, Micrococcus species, Listeria species, Nocadia species, Cornibacterium diphtheriae, Bacillus species, Bacolderia sepatia, Citropacter species, Escherichia coli, Enterobacter species, Klebsiella species, Shigella species, Elzenia species, Protea species, Salmonella species, Serratia species, Pseudomonas species, and Mycobacterium tuberculosis. And some examples for catalyst negative bacteria are uh, Streptococcus species, Enterococcus species and Clostridium species. Uh, that's all about the catalyst test. Uh, dear viewers, thank you for the support. Thank you.